Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf, your one and only, and today I'm going to be doing a rant video, and this rant video is going to be based on um, OBS. Now, disclaimer, I am not here just to talk crap to the devs of OBS or anything. This is just pretty much a few of the issues that I've experienced with it so far, and things that have happened to me with on my channel and everything. So, yeah, just to get that out there before anybody goes keyboard warrior inside of the chat. So... Pretty much the issues that I've had was pretty much recent, and I guess I'll talk about the first one that I had. Uh, I think the first one that I had is that I was is that I had to stop the recording, and for some reason, when I stopped the recording, my hotkey has stopped working. So I have my F9 key to as my hotkey. To uh, start recording and to record so yeah that key stopped working as soon as I stopped the um, like video just uh, try to fix everything then I tried to start it back up I pushed the hotkey I thought I well at least I thought I was recording again but uh, apparently I was not and most of these happened during my Dragon Blade series so yeah that is the thing, but I'm not too bummed out about it because I got better footage because I went in the second time. Now, I would be more pissed if it was like a first impression, if anything, and I didn't get the footage for it and I had to redo everything over again. Yeah, I would be more pissed if that was the case. But I am, I and I do mean I am quite pissed that I did lose the footage because because losing footage is basically like recording with your mic off or streaming with your mic off or not recording at all and playing a whole series which I have done before and I have streamed without my mic being on and recorded without my mic being on. It, it's happened before I believe we all have experienced it at least once in our lives. Well not all of us but some of us have experienced it and it's quite annoying but pretty much what happened to me on monday was pretty much i recorded my video not knowing that obs had reset my settings and this was around like i don't know i don't think it was like the recent update that changed it because around the time i had updated it there was no issues so it was more of a recent thing and I don't even know what to say it just pretty much just changed all a whole bunch of crap around and then I got triggered but I changed everything and fixed everything so yeah everything's fixed now but it sucks that I had had to go through it so basically the things that OBS had reset was my uh, format my format was mp4 and it changed it back to flv which we all know does not go into sony vegas so i cannot edit it so i was gonna convert it but then i noticed that it had also turned off my tracks so i just pretty much went back in and looked at it and yeah the only thing that had recorded through the tracks were um pretty much game sound and that was it so pretty much all my mic was not recorded or anything so that is what I'm mostly pissed about that I had lost all of that good footage and thinking to myself man this is gonna be a great video I can just go to sleep and you know wake up and edit it because I normally record my videos and go straight to sleep just uh, sleep for a while then I'll wake up in the afternoon and start recording for the next day's videos. But that that didn't turn out well. So I basically just recorded and so basically I recorded and I just went straight to sleep. I didn't even check what format it had saved it in because I'm pretty sure that it was always MP4. But yeah. <sighs> Things things happened. When I woke up, I looked at the file. I started to get ready to edit. 
Then I tried to put it in Sony Vegas and it didn't work. It wouldn't take it. Then I looked at the format and then I was really pissed. Then I keyboard word myself into Twitter, then just started ranting about it. But I don't think it was like the OPF devs fault themselves. It was probably like something I probably changed or touched. Uh, hopefully that wasn't the case, but yeah, I fixed everything now. Everything's good and God, if Ooh, I don't know what to tell you guys. I was so pissed last night. So basically when I saw it, I was just like, I was basically like, screw it. I'm just going to re-record uh, Fantasy, Fantasy War Tactics and then I'm just going to go to sleep. I'll record my next Dragon Blaze video in the morning, which is pretty much what I did today. And, and those two videos didn't come up as I wanted them to, like actual schedule wise. So yeah, that's that sucked. But normally I don't keep to my schedule as much as I would love to. Most of the time I pretty much upload whenever I, I want to or whenever I feel like it. I just feel like the, my normal schedule is just feels that way. But I have heard that you guys mostly watch my videos before you go to school and everything with the way I upload them around like 3.30 pretty much is when I normally upload them, but yeah, a lot of things went on last night. I was pissed. I couldn't even, I, I didn't want to deal with it. I just went straight to sleep. Didn't think about it anymore. It was over. I just, I just couldn't, but yeah, I, I already got yelled at <laughs> to quit losing footage. <laughs> ah, but you know, it, it's, uh, it's out of my hands. What can I say, guys? It, it just happens. But for a strong moment, as soon as I like saw all these problems happening, I was thinking of going straight to XSplit. But then I fixed everything. Then I was just like, all right, I'm going to give it one more chance. And if anything like major or severe happens, then I'm just going to switch to XSplit. But uh, ever since I changed everything, everything's been perfect, great. I don't think anything else has been wrong as, well, I would like to say. I, I Don't quote me on that. I don't know if anything has actually gone wrong. But thank you guys for um, your patience with my videos and understanding that these things happen and sometimes it's just not what you want at all and life doesn't always work like the way you want it to but for fuck's sakes OBS please for the love of fucking god please stop fucking me over I just want to make videos and share it with people and you know get them to laugh or have them enjoy a game they could potentially get into that's that's all I want that's all I ever wanted but I gotta say, it's been a long road and OBS has been there for me for a while. OBS is kind of difficult to start off with. So I do recommend XSplit because it's a lot easier for beginners and everything. And so you actually start to get to know OBS a little bit more because OBS is like extremely advanced, especially studios. If you guys are going into um, any OBS, I definitely recommend you try and learn OBS Studio, if anything, because it has a lot more to offer than anything. And to they actually add in separate, like, video tracks. That would be nice so I can move my face cam around and don't have to, like, mess with it. You know, OBS, please. Like, future features, please. That would be nice. Just, you know, separate video tracks. It's just saying, it's a thing. I mean, Elgato does it, please. But yeah, guys, I'm gonna I'm gonna leave you guys with that. But thanks for listening to me, bitch and moan, and just pretty much talk about my issues and my life going down the drain and me being triggered. I'm gonna end this video before I start getting triggered again. But <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you guys next time. Peace out.